All right, welcome back, everyone. Week seven, TGS against Habada. Um, built a quick team. It'd be fun. Pretty offensive. Um, but we'll see what we can do. Yeah, uh, this team is not overly fast, but he has some fast mons on his team. Uh, I have to be able to contain Bax and Zerud. They're like the biggest threats. Bax destroys my team. I don't really have much for that. Uh, Spectre I can kind of soft check a lot. Um, and then Zerud depends on his terror type. Probably like electric, I'd imagine. It's pretty good here. Uh, the other option you could go for is maybe I don't know something else that just resists flying. I mean, it's my best revenger for it. Um, so I can see electric could see water maybe, um, but shaman could be a defensive check to him. So I think electric just makes a lot more sense. Um, I don't know about fairy. I guess he could maybe, I don't know. I think Electric just makes the most sense, but yeah. Um, he could bring any of these nine ones. Uh, I kind of just semi-prepped Calflies for all of them. Um, Terra Electrode could be annoying as well, but we'll see. But this is basically what I brought. <laughs> uh, we have Scarf Chiyu. Terra Fire kind of just nukes his team when I need it to. It resists the Ice Shard, which is pretty nice um, from Bax. He doesn't really have, and then Aqua Jet obviously from Taurus is going to hurt, but those are like the primary check is either going to be Tauros or Mandibuzz, so I kind of had to pick between. I didn't want to run Dark, like Terra Dark, because it was weaker to Shard. Even though it looks more spammable, it does nothing to Mandibuzz. At least Fire can nuke through Mandibuzz and can hit um, Tauros um, decently, because it forces Tauros in, and I have semi decent checks for that. But our lead is Dragonite Eject Pack. Inner Focus. Um, I guess I don't necessarily need it to be inner focus. I can still be multi-scale if I want it to be. Um, but it's primarily my lead. I didn't really see a need for it to be inner focus. I mean, uh, um, multi-scale here, but I guess it could be decent off of lead, but nothing really kills me. So I was like, whatever, I'll just deal with it. It's eject pack with Draco, so it's fine. Um, I mainly wanted inner focus so I could still run like Earthquake and Extreme Speed. Earthquake for Spadef Slow King, I can still two shot with uh, no investment, so that's kind of the reason I'm, I'm bringing that. Thorn is some defensive set with a special attack and speed. Bleak when knockoff, you turn nasty plot. Knockoff's just there for AV on Slow King if he has it. Um, doesn't really do anything else other than that, but soft check. Soft chip, I mean. Um, but yeah, Bleak One is all I really need. Again, if it's Terra Electric, I can only do so much versus that. Like, the only other move I could run would be like Heat Wave or something. Um, I feel like I wanted U Turn just to pivot around and, and scout it. Um, so yeah, this has enough defense to guarantee live and adamant edge for miners. Basically, that's the count. Uh, Rev of Room, Air Balloon, um, has split death. It can live a um, Spectre Rear, Spec Shadow Ball after rocks. Um, or if it's like Scarf Spectre Air with that plus one, I can live that. Um, Gunk Shot, Iron Head, High Horsepower, Shift Gear. I'm not running Temper Flare because I think I have ways to weaken Fortress if need be um, with my team. And then Iron Treads, Assault Vest, Earth Power, Flash Cannon, Thunder, Rapid Spin. I just think this is funny, special. <laughs> um, if I can paralyze things like Mandibuzz or if he tries to go like hard, I don't know some other random crap, um, I can just thunder. It's the hardest hitting move for Mandibuzz. I didn't want to run physical, because um, with all his Intimidate spam, it's really annoying. Um, but yeah, and then Overquill, Crunch, Ice Beam, Toxic Spikes. Um, Ice Beam, two shots, max HP Landorus, which is good. Um, toxic assesses a lot of these other threats, and I'm running a lot of speed for like Adamant uh, Landorus, Adamant Vax. So I can toxic those, and then I have spikes on here, just just because. I mean, if I want to get up spikes, I can. Um, it helps, um, kind of weaken down, like slow king in range, um, as well as Tauros and Bax. Um, I couldn't fit rocks because I wanted AV, and I didn't really want to. I I wanted four moves, so yeah, that's basically it. So we'll go into the team with uh, with this. All right, we're here in the battle. Um, as you can see, I, I didn't even think of Rock, but he's Terra Rock's rude. Um, I said it was like electric because it resisted flying, but Rock is a good way to cover Chiyu fire type attacks as well. So, um, but yeah, uh, no Electro. It didn't bring, what did he not bring? 
No Electro, no Landorus. Okay. No, no G King. Okay, that's nice. Uh, my lead is still Dragonite, so I'm gonna lead Dragonite. Um, and he leads with Zarud here. Now he could probably just click Knockoff, I'd imagine. Um, I have no idea what his what he runs here. I'm just gonna go over Quill. I don't want to lose my eject pack yet. Okay, U-turn. That looks like it's not banded, so it could be scarfed as a way to check Chiyu. That's a that's a nice way. You'd probably have Aqua Jet as well. All right, I'd imagine he's probably gonna bring in Fortress here, or maybe Bax, because now Fortress positionally can get up as many hazards as he wants. Uh, I have to be careful with spinning with treads because Spectre can come in and check it. But again, he has to be wary of what I'm gonna click. Uh, he could just click Body Press into treads as well. Okay, he went backs. Interesting. Um, now, he could be max speed or something, but I'm just gonna fire up a Toxic here. Um, he is Choice Banded, so that's good to know. Uh, at least positionally, I'm gonna be able to get something in here. Alright, so he is fast. So he is Jolly. I wonder what he was Jolly for. Maybe fat oh fast Rotom. Right, okay, that makes sense. Um Does he have a ground type? No, he has no landers. I mean I could go into treads and just Oh I don't have Volt Switch anymore, never mind. Uh, I'm just gonna go Chiyu here. Um I'm just gonna Terra and I'm gonna fire off a flamethrower here. It goes into Tauros. Um, is he Assault Vested? He is Assault Vested. And we do get a burn. That's really fortunate for us. Uh, that's unfortunate for him. Um, is that actually just... It's clearly some type of offensive variant of it. Flamethrower. Uh, assault Vest. We did nothing. 26. Oh, you might just be Max Max. That's interesting. I mean, this isn't going to do anything, though, damage-wise, so... It's going to go Torn. He goes the root here. Um, I have no idea. I mean, I assume he's Scarfed. I mean, if he has this, right, it's got to be some type of Scarf. Um, so I'm going to go into Treads here. I'm going to assume he's going to click Terra Blast. He clicks U-Turn. Alright. At least I know he might funnel into clicking U-Turn at this point. So maybe I could try to stay in with Torn and click U-Turn. Um, I thought he might just play it safe. I have no idea what he's going to go into. I don't know. The Jack by Dragonite doesn't work as well with the Slow King gone. Um, at least it has extreme speed, so I can always hit backs with that. Um, it blocks extreme speed. This is a route going to be like impossible to kill. I mean, it looks like Rev has to be the win con here. Um, so I need chip on Mandibuzz. Boros Red got chipped. This is chip. Um, I mean, he's going to get up rocks, which is really important for me, so, um, he might just Volt Switch, eventually, and then he'll get him backs, and he'll hit me. Am I just Earth Power here? I want to get damage off and break the Sturdy. Okay, he does go for Stealth Rocks. Um, I'm just going to Rapid Spin, because I don't care. Body Press does a good amount of damage there. Um, now I'm going to go into my... Um, hmm. I might go Dragonite here. Now there's a couple things, you can just click Rocks again, and let me live with it having it up. Because then you'll bring in Spectre. Um, I, mean, I don't really have a check to that anymore, so... Uh, I'm just gonna go Dragonite. Uh, do I want to go Dragonite? I mean, I can just EP again, but if I lose this... It's not the end of the world. I don't know if he's cussed up or not. That's the only issue, right? Because if I click an attack here, it, depending on the roll, he could get in the cussed up and just get a Brox in. So, um, I'm thinking of just going Dragonite here. Goes for Body Press, okay? I didn't want to go Chiyu. 
because it didn't make sense to. Um, I have no idea what he's going to... You might just assume I might go for some type of attack and go into Zerud. Um, or you could just go into Mandibuzz, maybe. Um, should I just Draco? I don't want him to stay. I don't think he would stay in here, personally. I'm going to Draco Meteor. I mean, I could click Flamethrower and I'd kill him here. I guess he could just sack and get a Vax, but he has, like, Mandibuzz. Maybe he wants Mandibuzz healthy for Rev. He could just go Zerud here, because going Zerud is um, the safer play. I'm going to Draco. I really don't think he should stay in. Well, should he stay in? I mean, he sees I'm bulky. I don't think it's wise for him to stay in. I'm going to click Draco. I don't want him making, like, an aggressive uh, pivot out. Versus like going like Zerud or or if he goes Mandibuzz, I can get Chiyu in, which is really nice. Um, okay, he does bring Mandibuzz in. Is that special? Is that Spadef? Um, I did forty-five. That looks like it. It's probably mixed defensive here, which means Chiyu probably kills this, right? Uh, it's not guaranteed. Fire Blast would kill it. Um, what if Treads click Thunder? No, it does nothing. I think I have to go Chiyu here. Can I go Chiyu? Um, I think it might be safest for me to click Overheat, but I don't really want to let something in for free, but I don't think I have a choice here. I'm just going to click Overheat. Um, he goes into the Tauros as I do absolutely zero damage. Again, this Tauros can't do anything. He might just double again, because he knows he can. He can easily make a double into um, whatever he wants here. Um, probably the Zerud again, I would imagine. And he could honestly just click whatever move he wants. Um, I could go Treads then, to kind of block the Zerud. I might do that. We'll see what he clicks. Endeavors, okay. I mean, he might just Aqua Jet or something. I have no idea what he would click here. I'm going to be perfectly honest. Do I actually, do I, actually, do I even kill this with the Salt Vest? I just realized. I know this thing gets Endeavor. I've used it. Okay, EP is a roll. Thunder can kill. I mean, he can go Mandibuzz here. I don't want to just miss, though. That would suck. And I'll, I'll EP. Okay, he went Mandibuzz. A bit unfortunate for me, but... Um, how much I can do? I'm just going to Thunder. Hope I paralyze him. Could have done that twice. Okay, Citrus Berry. Interesting. And he did Roost. I'm just gonna Thunder again. <laughs> this Mon is... I don't need this Mon anymore. I could switch, but I'd assume he's just gonna passively click U-turn here. Spectre. Oh, he's so lucky. If, if I got landed and got a para, that was insanely risky on his end. I have no idea what um, his set is. He can obviously hit me with whatever kind of hit he wants at this point. Um, I don't know. Shadow Ball. Okay, Shadow Ball definitely just kills me regardless of, of the click here. Um, I live a hit with Chiyu, so that's fine. So I'm just gonna go for uh, Thunder, off chance. Okay, he goes into that. Um, at this point, I'm gonna go Chiyu. Oh, Flamethrower doesn't guarantee kill. Okay, he's gonna sack up. He's gonna sack off Tauros here. I think he should just sack off Tauros. I could probably abuse that and get my. Um, like a Torn or, or Dragonite in or something. Hmm. Eh, I'll just take the kill. 
We're probably bringing Zarud. Um, he's gonna click. He could just click Terra Blast. I mean, he probably had or Rock Slide. Uh, does he get Stone Edge? I don't think so. Um, yeah, it looks like Rev can win. I mean, I've broken the Sturdium Fortress, but I need it weaker. I wish I kept Temper Flare. I switched it to Horsepower at the last second for G King. Um, so yeah, this is a bit unfortunate. I have Iron Head though. Mandibuzz, I need weakened. Um, I should have thundered with treads. If I thundered, I could have two shot the Mandibuzz, which I thought he might go into. So that's my fault for not making the the aggressive play there. Um, yeah, he has to just click Terra Blast at this point. I mean, this Dragonite doesn't do anything at this point, so I'm just gonna sack it. Um, I want to keep my Rev uh, Balloon active because I just don't want to take unnecessary damage. Okay, so he did lock this. Um, I'm just going to extreme speed for some chip damage. Again, I mean, this fortress can come in at any point in time. Spectre, I assume it's Scarf Spectre here, maybe. Uh, I'm just going to shift gear. Okay, it's not Scarf, so he's been bluffing the entire time. What a madman. Well, actually, he doesn't really need to care about bluffing it, right? Um, Rev of Room. Oh, maybe I just low rolled him or something. I don't know. It's going to do a good amount of damage. Foul play is a roll to kill me. Knowing my luck, he'll get it. I could go for a flinch or I just go for the poison. I was gunk shot. Oh, we lived! Go! I mean, I don't have any other play. What's annoying is like I could be temper flare here, and I don't, I don't know if that actually makes contact or not. I mean, he'll probably just click body press here. I mean, this is useless at this point, but I can save as a sack later. So, I'm just going to save it. Oh, I did go for rocks. A bit unfortunate. Um, Rev is still alive as a sack, but Chi is going to take chip now. So, if he has Scarf Spectre, it could be uh, dangerous for us later. I assume he's going to Volt Switch or go for T-Wave or something. I'm just going to Bleak Wind. I don't even know if this kills. <laughs> this mod is so bulky. Yeah, my quick teams are not gonna fare well here. Okay, I know that doesn't kill. Scarf Spectre, maybe? I have no idea what his item is. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be frank here. I could probably spam fire move if I weaken this. I can spam fire blast. And try and win with that. I might do that. I might U-turn here. Sack off rev. Oh he trailblazed. Oh. That was smart. Actually, yeah. GG. Not much I can do there. And at this point, I'm gonna go for Fire Blast, hope he misses. But yeah, that should be the game. GG to my opponent. Yeah, I got no rocks up. He did just capitalize on the fact that he does kind of kill my rocks users, dreads and deoxys, and like you can kind of funnel around it with uh, with fortress and remove it pretty well. Um, I couldn't really do much. I mean he just yeah he knew Chiyu was my only way to like kind of revenge things and break open stuff so he just created enough pivots to get around it with Zarud and, and Tauros. A rock I didn't even think of. Um, there wasn't really much I could do about that. Um, under the same vein as water I said that maybe Shaman could have checked it. But this probably was assault busted. These are rude. 
or maybe it was um uh Shuckaberry, perhaps. I have no idea. But uh yeah. There wasn't a whole lot I could have done there at the end. Positionally he, he got me. Um this not dying to rocks was a little unfortunate, but like I said it was still a sack regardless, but the Trailblaze, he kinda checkmated me at that point. Um then maybe I should have sacked and gotten four. Oh no, because then he would have trailblazed anyways versus uh, Chia, probably. That makes the most sense, in my opinion. Yeah. GG's.